Welcome to PGA Tour 2K23. My name's John McCarthy, and I am packing all the golf lessons. So I invite you to use these lessons to get you swinging that club like a pro and getting that little white ball around the course as best you can. Let's crack into it. Pull back on the swing stick to start your swing when your golfer is at the top of their backswing. Press the swing stick forward to finish the swing. Give it a try. That's what we're looking for. After each shot, you will get feedback about your accuracy in the bottom right-hand corner. In the middle of that circle, there's a white stripe. And you need to keep your swing within that white stripe if you want your shot to be accurate. Now let's try another swing and remember to keep it within that white stripe. Good job, that's what we're looking for. And you're also gonna receive feedback on your swing timing, and that's the meter that kind of wraps around the top of your swing accuracy indicator. Your backswing timing refers to the point at which you transition from backswing into downswing. If you do this too early, you're gonna reduce the power of your shot. If you do it too late, you're gonna add power, but increase the difficulty of the swing. Your downswing timing refers to how quickly you flick that swing stick forward. If your downswing is too fast, you'll hook it, and if it's too slow, you'll slice it. Let's try to get perfect timing on this next swing. Good job on that one. Congratulations, you've got the basics down, Pat. Can't wait to see you use some of these lessons out on the course. In this lesson, we're gonna talk about one of the most important skills you can have at your disposal, and that is putting. Now to begin your putt, pull back on the swing stick. The farther you pull back, the stronger your putt will be. The back swing meter at the bottom of your screen is going to give you a target for where your strength should be. Now as you pull back, you want to wait until the indicator gets in that white part of the back swing meter and then press forward.
That's the stuff. The putt weight is how hard you hit your putt. To set your putt weight, move the aim marker with the aim stick towards or away from you. The further away from you the marker is, the stronger your putt will be. Since this is a little bit downhill, you'll want to ease up on the weight, so move that aim marker a little bit closer to you by pulling down on the aim stick, and then have a go at this putt and see what you can do. Hmm, not quite. Let's try that again. Hmm, let's uh, just go ahead and give that another try. Not quite. Uh, let's reset. Try again. Not quite. Let's reset and try again. Uh, how about we try that again? All right, that didn't pan out. Let's give it another go. Well done on that lesson. Those moving dots on the grid are telling us that your putt's gonna break a little bit to the right, so you will have to aim to the left to compensate. Use the aim stick to make adjustments before putting so that you can drop this one in the hole. Give it a go.
Well, that didn't work. Let's try that one again. Uh, I don't think you got that quite. Let's let's best to try that again. All right, that didn't pan out. Uh, let's try that again. That didn't quite pan out, I guess. Uh, we'll try again. Uh, didn't quite get that. Let's try that one again. Well, that was well done. And with that, you are ready to pop the lights out on these courses. As with any skill in the game of golf, practice makes perfect. And before too long, you'll be feeling your way around these greens like a pro.